Stochastic in Seconds presents probability generating functions. The probability distribution that's associated with the discrete random variable is a probability mass function p of x. But what many people don't know or don't think about is that there's also an associated probability generating function, p of s. By definition, the probability generating function is the expected value of s to the x, where s is a dummy variable that will be eventually set to either 0 or 1. Don't worry about it now. From this definition, the probability generating function in expanded form is simply the sum of the probabilities that x is equal to i times s to the power i. Sometimes this sum will converge to a simple algebraic formula. And for many known probability distributions, the algebraic expression of the probability generating function, or PGF, may be found in textbooks or even on Wikipedia. Once the PGF for the random variable is known, the probability that x is equal to i may then be found by taking the i derivative of the PGF with respect to s, dividing by i factorial, and setting s is equal to 0, which is equivalent to performing a Taylor series expansion about the point s is equal to 0 and taking the coefficient of s raised to the power i. So why would you ever want to use probability generating functions of a discrete random variable, which requires differentiation and all, instead of simply using the probability mass function? Well, PGFs are particularly useful when trying to find the probabilities of a convolution or sum of random variables, as the PGF for the sum is the product of the individual PGFs. Let's say, for instance, that we would like to find the probability that the sum of a discrete uniform random variable x1 on the interval 0 to 3 and the Poisson random variable x2 with an expectation of 2 is equal to 5. Finding this probability mass function is really quite difficult. But using PGFs, we know that the PGF of the sum is equal to the products of the PGFs for x1 and x2, whereupon the probability that s is equal to 5 is simply the coefficient of s to the power of 5 in the Taylor series expansion, which is 10.23%.